Hello from Palermo, Sicily. I just discovered this beautiful park. I love it. Right near my home um, and hearing the birds sing and it's beautiful. Anyway, <laughs> I wanted to talk to you about, um, this is for the men, <laughs> ways to be successful in online dating. Okay. For once, uh, there's a dearth of men as opposed to women being online, and I'll give you some tips. Um, don't post photos of yourself where your face can't be seen. I don't care if you can scuba dive, so can I, but I can't see your face. I'm not impressed if I can't see what you look like, okay? And don't show me pictures of your house no, of your, uh, what else don't I want to see? The fish you caught. No clear, visible pictures of you. I can't stress this enough. What are you hiding? Why don't you want someone to see you online? <sighs> this is so basic, people. Okay. Don't expect me to do all the work. So when you want me to get in touch with you on WhatsApp, no, I'm not going to do it. You can get in touch with me. That's how it works. Men and women are different. I don't have to get in touch with you. So if you want to talk to me on WhatsApp, you're going to have to ask me for my details and then we'll go from there. If I'm interested, remember, if you just showed a picture of you scuba diving, I'm probably not gonna be interested because I don't know what you look like. And I'm a very visual person. It's not just for men to be visual. I hate that myth. It's like, no, I'm gonna care about what you look like too, same as you care about what I look like. Um, you know, say, and then when you do start conversing with people, if you just say hi with no picture, you're not going to get an answer. If you just say hi with a picture, you're still not going to get an answer. Uh, as a woman, we get a lot of highs and hellos. Say something more interesting to spark my sparkling conversation. <laughs> I'm currently off dating apps, but I've been on them and uh, this is what I've learned. Okay, so don't try and hide the fact that you're older than your picture. See, a lot of this stuff stems from pictures being not true to life. Uh, one time, this was several years ago, I met a guy on, an, on a date, I think it was match.com, I can't remember. Anyway, he clearly told me his height, so I thought, oh good, I'm gonna wear my three inch boots, three inch high heel boots. I don't have those anymore, because I'd hurt myself. Um, and when I got there, <laughs> he was about six inches shorter than me. I mean, just be honest. It doesn't mean I'm not gonna meet you. Um, Lately, I've been honest about my age because I don't think it matters, but I don't want you to act all shocked about it when you find out. So why should you not know? Uh, I've dated men much younger than me, and I'm sure I'll continue to do that. Uh, it's just everybody has preferences. And why is it that everybody is so shocked when Keanu Reeves is dating someone about five minutes older than him? I don't find that shocking at all. And then nobody bats an eye over some guy that's married to somebody 35 years younger. No, no, no people. Wake up. Okay, so I'm just a little bit disgusted um, by how people deal with the online dating apps. And I know plenty of people that ended up getting married and having real relationships. So I'm not putting them down entirely. I'm just saying, listen, men, there's far more men than women on. So you're gonna have to step up your game to get a quality woman. 
this is the only place where you're gonna have to work harder probably is online because there's more men do I need to repeat this um, it's just how it is and actually you know in real life here's what I'm noticing another tip for you guys if you're not ready to be in a relationship don't pretend that you are don't keep people on the back burners so you can wait for your number one I've had that happen to me and when I figured it out finally because I'm kind of naive about dating um, I was pretty embarrassed because I expect more from people and I'm learning how to not expect more from people but just the fact that you're on the back burner I'm just not a back burner kind of gal so that's gonna help you a lot to not keep all of these irons in the fire <laughs> um, I mean sure if you want to date different people um, be honest because I think honesty is the best policy we don't need details though but no one's going to expect you to marry them on the first date I've had people get really serious on just one date and you're like I don't even know you and you know I've got to say uh, because of my naivete I've uh, learned how to wait longer and just wait and see how people are so and they and people always reveal ourselves isn't that true uh, do people mean what they say can they be trusted trust takes a while to build up are you gonna do what you say um, that's a biggie so have fun out there take care of yourself stay healthy and I'll see you in the next video ciao grazia